three times is a charm. How's that go? Yeah, it's three times I'm doing this. I totally forgot what I was going to do, but it's a welcome, a walk and talk again. It's a review and talk. Time. Ladies and gentlemen, kids of all ages, this is the Samsung Gear 360 2017 model. It's a wonderful camera. A beautiful day to go out there and capture the moment in 360 when the sun is not fully out. And it will really shine. It does 4K at 24 frames per second, the highest resolution of the camera. And it's restricted with uh, the environments that you shoot in. If you're indoors, it's going to uh, limit you to 5 to 15 minutes of uh, video. And if you set down to 2K7, and lower resolution 1440 1080p 720 it would record until the battery is depleted or the SD XC card runs out with USB type C external power source I have done last night a beautiful uh, drive and talk just heading out nothing special and that'd be like one or two times I use my camera at night time. So I'm not sure how it's going to come out just after the sun uh, went down. I've done maybe one time lapse by mistake and walking and talking. I don't know if I liked it or not. Maybe when the camera is uh, stationed like this and just let it run, I'll be happy using it. I am told that there are many hints out there how to do uh, videos and how to hold the camera. One thing is, we're all new, this is what we're going to do, we're going to grab a video real quick. You need to go out there and get a tripod or a selfie stick that is smaller in diameter, same size to smaller. This is called the Zinkos. And the reason for that is, you can see how it, nice and close to you, it doesn't stick further out in diameter of the camera. On the bottom you can have a tripod stand, you don't want to take your camera and stand it up like this because it's going to fall. So no matter how much you try to balance this the right way, to get that shot, the gentle breeze will make it fall. Or somebody comes to the table and they bang it, it'll fall. You know there's going to be a kid that's going to get very curious and that's the look you're going to get when it just three second drops. They don't have replaceable lenses. There is a rubber seal on the bottom, a one quarter twenty thread. This rubber seal clicks off, exposes two screws. This slides down, this clips off. Before you clip this off, you unscrew each of the metal rings. When you pull the front off, the button falls off. These three buttons, yes, three buttons. There's one on top, one on bottom one on inside that holds the uh, things here two sensors and your battery it's an aluminum case inside and these lenses are glued on by adhesive so if you do break your lens scratch your lens you can take this lens off and still use the camera with this inner lens 
take a nice wide screwdriver get underneath there and slowly try to pry maybe apply a little bit of heat in the warm room to get it off I've been there I've done it I'm very happy with this budget camera so if you're looking to get into 360 this is the way to go 50 to 150 dollars on eBay make sure the seller's gonna want a return a lot of sellers don't like returns and their resellers. Many people have a Samsung camera. This is a gift they get. So I am going to be uh, talking more about the Samsung and doing an overview of this over again. And I want to thank you. It's just the GoPro hero version. Yapping and chapping. Have a great day, everybody.